Hi everyone, we're doing another test here on Microsoft Teams Room for Windows this time. We are running version 4.12.139, which is um, one of the newer versions. Um, we've got a very unforgiving space going on here. We've got slappy walls and very loud aircon and people talking outside. We have invested some really nice table mics and a good digital signal processor as well going into the NTR. However, you can still hear. It's a bit of an unforgiving space, the slap of noise, the claps and things, um, and uh, it might be distracting for people on the call at the end, even though they can hear me quite clearly. I can now, as an end user, enable noise suppression into the Microsoft Teams call. So if I now press that, as you can see on the video, you will now hear my voice go a lot clearer. It's now enabled, and you can hear that the room sound has disappeared quite a lot. My voice is much more up front. Uh, lots of and things will disappear um, and also it means that um, it's less of a distraction it means that people think about the meeting a lot more uh, a lot less one thing we will say is that as an end user that's a bit of a fast to remember to do that each time so administrators can then push that as an xml file uh, which means that i as a business if i wanted to send that to um, all of my rooms easy to do i can just push that in the XML file, or all of my Microsoft Teams rooms, and that means that um, uh, high noise suppression will be applied to all of those spaces. So very quickly, I'll do an AB again. I'll go off. You can hear that uh, the room is a lot more you know, open and big. You can hear me clearly, but it's maybe a little bit more distracting. And if we go to high noise suppression again, you can now hear that my voice is much more up close. <laughs> I might just quickly go to the room next door and show you in a smaller room, so bear with. <laughs> there we go. So I'm now in the other room. Hopefully you can hear maybe a little bit of a boxier sound in this. I've got a uh, Poly R30 here, which has got really good audio uh, uh, noise suppression and advanced AI in there to make the room sound as good as it can do. However, it may be that, you know, we want some more improvement on there as well. So let's enable high noise suppression. Now it's kicked in. Hopefully you'll hear that that's a bit more up front as well, a bit more less of a noise sound. And again, we can apply that as administrators to always be on. So if I turn it off again, there it is without the noise suppression. And now I'm going to enable it one more time. You can hear the noise suppression is kicked in. So that is the latest version of Microsoft Teams Room for Windows, which has got noise suppression tools built into the software as well. So no matter if you've got a really good uh, digital signal processors in your room, some advanced AI, you can still improve on that. If you've got some really basic audio capture tools in those spaces, this will dramatically improve those as well. Uh, if you need any more information, just give us a contact on the, uh, on the email. Thank you very much.